September 16, 2020, I'm Mr. Ochoa, Principal of Sunny Middle School. We're going to continue to focus forward this school year. This month is Aviation History Month. Learn more about it by searching Google or finding books virtually. Our 11 commitments that we follow here in our school district. Number seven, maintain personal balance and positive mental health. Make sure that you're utilizing whatever means necessary to support yourself. Whether find a small corner in your house or somewhere in, around your area where you can think and reflect about things to make things better. Remember, we are all in this together and it takes time to get things better, but we'll all be there soon. Vision statement. At Sunnyman Middle School, we're empowering the Sunnyman community to create a successful future for its students in a safe environment that demonstrates equity and excellence. At Sunnyman Middle School, our instructional focus is focus note taking which is text annotation inside of the readings that you do virtually, you can use Kami to highlight items with the main idea and details to support it. Student-led collaborative discussions or think pair share is an example of that. Discussing with your peers to find out more information together, you guys can get more successful in making a decision on the question. Checking for understandings when your teacher asks you questions to see if you understand the material. Improving reading stamina across the curriculum means reading as much as possible to improve your reading. Non-linguistic representations is the digital classroom that you're in with Google Classroom if it's organized and successful for you to learn, has visuals, and provides important details. Report bullying. Use your cell phone camera QR code to below to take a picture of this and go to the forum to make sure you report any type of bullying. Document today has been being passed out of art kits here at, on site during lunchtime from 11 to 1 on the Heacock parking lot. Continue to show up to get your art kit. It's for all students. Thank you. Annual information update. Some of you have been receiving an annual information update phone call and also uh, emails in regards to completing the annual update. Every student and parents, every student's parent is supposed to complete this. So make sure you complete this for important vital information for the future of our learning. Now we go to some of our teachers. Owen Torres, a seventh, eighth grade ELA teacher. He teaches seventh and eighth grade language arts in his second year teaching at Sunny Middle. He knows it's not the normal way to start the school year, but he's determined to make the most of this opportunity. He's excited for the school year. Random fact, he loves making things like music, art, carpentry, writing, etc. And over the summer, he learned how to make all sorts of things in the kitchen, including mozzarella, beef jerky, pesto, and lumpia. About me, Mr. Hernandez, seventh grade mathematics teacher. He's Mr. Hernandez's third year teaching mathematics at Sunny Middle School. He received his degree from Kelsey San Bernardino and he loves math. Math is everywhere and can be used in different aspects of our lives. There is no such thing as a math person since anyone can learn math. Making math comprehensible, relatable, and interesting is my passion. Some students enter my class hating math and finish the year strong with a different output of mathematics. He always tries his best to implement different strategies to make learning math easy. I'm hoping I will not be the only math teacher this year, but a mentor and help you guide through seventh grade. Mrs. Cordova assists the eighth grade Spanish teacher and also seventh grade DLI teacher. She teaches Spanish and seventh grade Spanish DLI, second year at Sunny Middle, seventh year teaching Spanish. She loves teaching both language and cultural aspects of it. She receives her Bachelor of Arts from University of Redlands, her Spanish Master's of Arts degree from San Diego State University, and her Master's of Arts degree in learning and teaching from University of Redlands. She decided to start the virtual learning adventure with each of the students during the summer. She virtually volunteered assisting first-time parent owners. The winner of the background virtual contest was Janaya Harris. Congratulations, Ms. Janaya Harris, on your wonderful background. Our Star Award winner of the week, Amy Soto Lopez. Congratulations. Spirit, we follow spirit here. This week, I'll talk about responsibility. How ready are you? Making sure to check Google Classroom before and log in five minutes early. Stay focused and follow class procedures and actively participate. Email your teacher for a phone or Zoom appointment and add it to your calendar if you don't understand any content in the class. Also, make sure that if you're having Chromebook issues to reach out through a ticket or let your teacher know that you're having issues, so get it fixed. Thank you so much. Continue to focus forward. Have a happy Thanksgiving week break next week. We will have the whole entire week off for you to enjoy Thanksgiving and enjoy your family. Make sure you thank someone close to you. Have a wonderful day.